go to the inbox. Hey, Spencer. Uh, so I got this bottle of Montenegro a while back to make full Montes, um, but I'm wondering if there's anything else I can make with it. Montenegro is a great choice. I always have a bottle of Montenegro at my bar. It's awesome because it's versatile in that it tastes great on its own, or you can switch Montenegro out for other ingredients in drinks. For instance, the full Monte that Nathaniel was making is kind of like a Manhattan bourbon and Montenegro instead of vermouth, except it's very heavy on the Montenegro, but more or less kind of-ish like a Manhattan. Though if you did want to make a Manhattan and switch out the vermouth for Montenegro, it's a great drink. So I'm going to show Nathaniel and you all how to make a paper plane. For ingredients, we'll need the star of the show, Montenegro. We're going to use Buffalo Trace Bourbon. Why? Because I like it. Aperol, kind of in the Campari-ish family. And some fresh squeezed lemon juice. Shall we build the drink? We shall. Let's get started. In a shaker full of ice, we will add three quarters of an ounce of Buffalo Trace. Sploosh, three quarters of an ounce of Aperol. Dooge, three quarters of an ounce of lemon juice. Kablam! And three quarters of an ounce of Montenegro. Wham! Then we'll stir until cold. Join me. Once cold, we'll strain into a rocks glass. Ew! The Aperol is going to give it that orangey, vibrant color because everything else is kind of in the, uh, the brown-ish zone. So it's got a really nice color there. And now, let's just cut off a little swath of lemon and we'll express the oils. Whoosh, and just give that a rub around the old rim of the glass so you get that nice lemony zing every time you take a sip and drop it in. What do you think of that? Mmm. Mmm. The paper plane is an awesome drink because it's truly hard to make a bourbon drink that is refreshing. And this is refreshing. The bourbon is sweet-ish, right? Uh, the Aperol and Montenegro are both sweet. The Aperol is more tart though. And then the lemon juice, being lemon juice, just ties the whole thing together and it's super refreshing. I prefer it not on the rocks because we've already chilled it by stirring it. And I don't want it to be watered down because it's perfect just the way it is. But if you wanted to nurse it for a while, it'll get watered down. It's totally good on the rocks too. We want to thank Black Cow for hosting us in their beautiful location. You should come on down and have a drink at their beautiful bar and enjoy the view of the park. We really appreciate you hosting us. So thank you, Black Cow. This has been a paper plane and this has been happy hour. You can learn more about this cocktail and many other cocktails at meanspirits.com. You can download their app for your smartphone, which is a smart move because it has all kinds of information, what to make, how to make it, where to get the stuff. It's all in there. So download the app for your smartphone or you can follow them on Instagram at main underscore spirits. And as always, we implore you to drink deliciously and responsibly.